What's going on guys? Welcome back to another vlog. Today I want to give you a quick update about my psoriasis journey and today is day four for the vegan diet slash psoriasis diet that I've been working on uh, since four days ago. So one thing I want to say is first of all is that I'm really amazed the fact that I'm even at day four because I thought I'm not gonna last a day. Um, last time I tried it I lasted half a day and I gave up and mainly that's because probably didn't have the ingredients, the food, and so on to do what I needed to do to eat. And right now what I'm doing different is I'm actually eating properly. I'm eating uh, vegan meals. I go to restaurants. I order things. Uh, I have friends that are vegans too. They're helping with that as well. So it makes it a little bit easier. And to my surprise, I'm actually not really opposed to the food. Like it's not horrible. It's not like I was, uh, I totally expected that everything is going to be like not my taste. I wouldn't like it. I'll force myself to eat it. But right now it's like I'm surviving, it's not bad. And what's super interesting to me, and this is not by any means me making conclusions, but I'm looking at my elbow, which is my main indication of how things are going. And I'll tell you what, it's looking better. Now, yes, I have had a shower about a couple hours ago. I did put cream, but I mean, normally after this long since, like it's been two or three hours or so, I don't know exactly, but normally by this point, um, I'll see flakes, I'll see covered in white flakes and I'll know that, hey, it's back again. But right now it's looking like it's getting better. The other, the other spots that I have, I've noticed, are getting better too. Now again, I don't wanna jump in conclusions. I don't wanna say this vegan diet was the cure. Um, probably not, but who knows? I'm only four days in. Once I hit a week, I'll know where we're standing. Once I hit two weeks, I'll know for sure where we're standing. And when I get to the one month challenge that I set myself, then I'll know for a fact, first of all, is it actually helping, is it not? And if I do see major improvements, if I do see everything is being uh, removed slowly uh, from my body, all the spots that I have normally, then I'll know that obviously being vegan, doing the UVB light, removing stress, one of those three, if not all together, helped it. So now I just have to slowly continue doing what I'm doing and then once I hit that one month and once I see the results I want, uh, then I can decide either continue being vegan or introduce uh, one thing at a time uh, in durations of a month to see if they affect in any way. So in my case, I'll probably introduce um, maybe beef or maybe chicken, I don't know, and then wait a month to see if that had any effect. If not, introduce something else. So bottom line is uh, elimination process starting back from the basics. So I'm doing a plant-based vegan diet and then slowly gonna introduce to it. Maybe I'll even stay vegan. I'm not sure yet because it's too early to say, but I'm watching documentaries. I'm really recommending watching The Game Changers. I just watched that the other day. And maybe a lot of it is not scientifically backed up and maybe a lot of it is lies because the people that were on it make money or whatever the case is. But a lot of it does make sense to me. And one of the things that I took away from that and it really made sense for me with the whole vegan thing is the fact that animals are eating food, they're eating the plants, and they're just the middleman of us getting the nutrition from the plants. So if you think about it, when you eat uh, an animal, right? When you eat steak, when you eat the chicken, you're really eating the, all the things that they've consumed first and now they're transferring it to you. So that's one way to look at it. The other things that the movie or the documentary showed is how the blood becomes clear uh, and the blood flow is so much better and so on. How other benefits that come from it as far as energy and strength and so on. So like, let alone the fact that psoriasis might be uh, treated and go away, but it's also gonna help me in any other aspect as far as being uh, better in fitness, better in strength, being more energetic and so on. So why not if that's the case? So I'm not by any means being an advocate here for become vegan, save the world, accept yourself and so on. I'm just saying try something new for yourself if you haven't. Vegan is something that I'm trying. If you think that you like what you're seeing so far from my last couple of videos, then obviously give it a try as well. If you think that maybe the other diets that are out there, uh, aside from vegan diets are good, then give them a try too. But definitely try something. Sitting there and, uh, and just complaining about how your psoriasis is getting worse is definitely not gonna make it better, I'll tell you that. I've seen some other people on other videos commenting how they're frustrated, they're giving up, like it's getting worse. I mean, you can. Letting the internet know that is definitely one way to vent about it, but I don't think that's gonna help you, right? You might, for that moment, it might help, but your psoriasis is still gonna be there five minutes later, 10 minutes later, a day later. So jump on the opportunity to try something, stick to it for a while and see if that works. 
follow my journey if that helps you in any way, follow your own journeys, try new things, and then maybe document them too to hold yourself accountable. That what I'm doing with this channel really held me accountable to not only to you guys, but also to myself, because I can look back, see what I did, look when I did the last uh, video, whatever, and then know that, okay, last video I did something like that, it didn't work, let me try something new. So that keeps reminding me. Now on top of that, I can see visually what I look like, right? Like I can see, okay, my skin is looking okay right now, maybe a little bit of redness here and there. A week from now, maybe it's gonna be gone, so I'll know that was progress. It's one thing for other people to tell me, oh yeah, your skin is looking better. It's another thing when I see that, right? Because I'm my own worst enemy, I can judge everything that's going on, so I wanna make sure everything's clear. Guys, this is it, this is just a quick update. If you like this video, make sure you leave thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in the next video.